Hello, I'm Philip Brunel, Artistic Director and Founder of Vocal Essence and Organist Choir Master at Plymouth Congregational Church in Minneapolis. Today's composer is a wonderful Czech composer, Leos Janacek, born in 1854, died in 1928. Janacek was, along with Dvorak and Smetana, regarded as one of the three most important composers to come out of the Czech Republic. He was born in, I love the name of this town, B-R-N-O, Brno. Uh, he studied there and then he went on to Prague and while he was a student there, can you just imagine, he was at the conservatory, he was so poor he could not afford to have a piano to practice on, so he made a piano on the table that was of the same shape and practiced that way before he would go to his lesson. It was a few years ago that my wife Carolyn and I and friends were in Brno and went to see the house of Janacek there. Uh, it was wonderful just to kind of sense his life and what it was there. He uh, moved then back to Prague, but then he, most of his time was in Brno at the conservatory. Between about 1900 and 1910, he wrote a number of choral pieces one of them, which we have performed here at Plymouth Church, is the setting of the Lord's Prayer, a piece for choir, tenor, organ, and harp. And the very end of it, it's in six little parts, but the very end of it is very strong. When you get to the text, lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. And you have this kind of thing. And then the choir comes in and sings, lead us not into temptation. It's wonderful, very big. And it's one of the things about Janacek is that endings are often just a surprise. They aren't kind of, oh yes, here it is, we're coming into the ending. It just sometimes ends very abruptly. And if you've never listened to his Sinfonietta for six trumpets and orchestra, oh, you want to do it. It's an amazing, wonderful piece. So one of the other pieces of this period was a setting of Ave Maria. And I'm going to have Maria Jetty join me, not just because her name is Maria, but, but to sing this beautiful piece, which is for soprano, uh, or it could be tenor. And then it has a violin part and also the organ or piano. This is Ave Maria, and of course I said to uh, Maria, as long as we're going to do it, it would be wonderful if you would sing it in the original Czech. My version. Your version of it, and here it is. Still, I'm 
Thank you, Maria. Music of Janacek. Well, late in life, at age 72, he wrote this great piece called the Glagolithic Mass, which Vocal Lessons has performed over at the St. Paul Cathedral. And it was a great um, challenge because we did sing it in the Slovenian language. Uh, we had a wonderful coach, a young woman named Helena Brin, who helped us learn to say it correctly. And it was a great, great, wonderful piece, very tempestuous, very big. It was one of his most important pieces and one that is still performed very often. Late in life, actually throughout his life, he wrote a series of pieces that were called On the Overgrown Path. He put them together. Uh, they were pieces that really kind of fit his whole thing about nature and wandering in the woods. And I'd like to close with, because of his interest in folklore, with this little one that was called Come With Us, music of Janacek. Have a wonderful day.